Hello beautiful peeps of YouTube and welcome. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Kat and you're watching Planning Calm. And here in this channel, I love, love, love to share with you all the many ways I can help you plan a calmer life. Now in this video, I wanted to do something uh, because I actually got requested on Instagram. And if you're not following me on Instagram, it is here, located here. And one of the main questions I get asked is, Kat, how do you organize all of your planner accessories and supplies and all that stuff? So it is Saturday while I'm filming this and I'm getting ready to clean my office. And so I thought I would share all of the items that I use to organize my planner supplies with you. So I hope you enjoy and I hope you find it helpful. If you do, don't forget to give this video a big old like that really helps a small channel like mine get noticed on this platform. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more planner and organizational content. Um, here to help you plan your way to calm. So let's dive in. Okay. Um, the first items here, and this is gonna seem a little random, and a lot of these items are gonna seem random. I don't apologize for it, it is what it is. <laughs> but uh, the first item I have here are these Ipsy bags. Now, I got these used on, oh, I can't remember what site it was, but uh, the person was selling a whole bunch of Ipsy bags. I used to have Ipsy like 10 years ago or something. Sorry, my husband's coughing in the background if you hear him. <laughs> um, but I used to have Ipsy years ago and I never threw out the bags. Um, so I just added a couple of these ones that I got uh, used to my collection. And these are great for storing various planner items, accessories, pencils, erasers, uh, washi tape, etc. especially if you like to plan on the go. And they have a variety of patterns and prints. Super awesome, super convenient, and super affordable. The next item, and you've seen this already on my channel, and that is a utility pouch. Now this one is from Delphonics, and I got this several months ago, and I absolutely love it. I love to use this um, when I'm planning on the go, when I'm planning around the house. Uh, I live in a three level house, so um, if I want to, like if you want to go to the media room, which is in our basement, and um, watch a movie with my husband or some friends, and I want to plan, I just, put everything, literally everything in here that I will need and I can just carry it along with me in the house or on the go. I love this. It's a great investment. It comes with lots of pockets. It's great for organizing all your planner supplies and needs. The next item, and again, you've seen these before, but these are uh, just little pouches uh, that I got from Amazon. They come in a pack of eight or 10, and they're great for just holding little things. What I love about them is that they're clear, so they're easy to see what you have in there if you don't want to have time to kind of like guess the contents inside type of thing. These are super reasonably priced, uh, great to have, great to slip into any planner bag, and it's just great Great, great, great item to use. Two albums that I use to hold my planner stickers. One of the most frustrating things about being a planner and avid planner is that it can be difficult to organize your stickers. So I love these. This is a really inexpensive. I got these from the dollar store, I believe. And these are really inexpensive and a great way to organize and store your planner stickers. And I love that. Next up is uh, this Moterm. Now, when you are trying to figure out what kind of planner style is great for you, sometimes if you wanna keep things simplified uh, and compact, I would go with something like this. So this can ask, serve as a, a planner, like a, a, what's that called? Traveler's Notebook, there we go. Traveler's Notebook planner, if you want to use it like how I do and like jot things down and things like that. And it can also be used as a wallet. The next thing that I love to use, and it's a little dusty, <laughs> is, uh, these plastic containers, and I got these on Amazon, and they're super inexpensive. There's crumbs in here, I don't know why. <laughs> but this, I, I use this to organize my books in my planner cart. So uh, I typically, like if I have sticker books or other books, I like to kind of stack the items in here like this and just put them on the shelf. And then when I need things, I just take it off the shelf or I just reach in it on the shelf. And it's so great at containing all of your planner accessories and supplies. It's super, super great. Now, another thing I love, I got this from Amazon, is this um, stationary 
holder. So I use these to organize and store my Tombows, my dot pens, and my dot markers, and my regular pens. And it's great because it's super stylish. I actually got this idea from Julie's Plants. I saw it featured on her channel and I absolutely love it. It was just, it, to me, it just looked like it makes sense. It's perfect to be put on a desk, in your planner cart. It's just great at containing all of your markers, all of your pens, all of your writing tools, and it makes it easy to find and use and grab, and it's just great. Next up are one of my favorite organizing tools, and that are these, it's these containers here. Now these ones I got at the dollar store, and they are super inexpensive. I think I paid 50 cents, and I have two of them here, and I just use these to store a variety of miscellaneous items that I use for planning. So this one here, I store my washi tape in. This one, I just kind of use it as a junk <laughs> container. These are a great tool to keep your uh, planning accessories and supplies nice and organized, and they're so inexpensive. Alrighty, coming down to the last two items. Now, this is something I really love. This isn't for everybody, but I absolutely, I, there was a time when I was all about Ray Dunn, and I love um, these Ray Dunn pieces. Now, this one here I got uh, from the the website The Right Stuff uh, years ago, and I absolutely love it. And it's a great, like when I have this on my desk, I always get compliments and people always say things. And so I have this piece here, I got a number of these pieces, and I also got um, this piece here, which says things, and I have one that matches this that says stuff. And I love to put these on my desk and just hold a variety of things. So if I wanna stick some washi tape in here, I just throw it in there, put a lid on, nobody needs to know what's inside, but you know that your planner su supplies and accessories are you know, tucked away and you know easy to, to reach them when you want them. So and lastly, <laughs> lastly, one of my favorite organizational pieces is this planner caddy. Now this was super inexpensive. I got it at Michael's and I believe I got it on clearance or a really heavy discount. I have a planner video on this where I feature how I use this, but this is a great tool if you wanna plan on the go, especially if you are going to uh, plan out a friend's house or if you're uh, planning in a different room or floor in your house, it's great to put all your planner supplies and accessories in here and it's just great. I have a whole bunch of different things I keep in here and I keep my planner stickers and all that stuff in here and it's just so great to have a nice organized spot to put all of your planner accessories and supplies. It's inexpensive, it's great and it's just a wonderful tool to um, help you to, you know, make your planning less complicated. So here you have it, my friends. This is all the uh, the items that I have to share with you to help make planning a lot more easy and effective and less stressful for, for you. Uh, I love to plan, I love planning, but sometimes just depending on the type of things that you purchase, it can get really overwhelming really overwhelming. So I like to have different items to help me organize all of my planner goodies that I like to use and enjoy. And just having it organized really helps me to make sure that I am planning my way to calm. So there you have it, friends. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, you know what to do. Don't forget to give this video a like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more planner content to come. And until next time, my beautiful friends, take care, be well, be blessed, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye, planner peeps. Baby, you give me ice and fire. You're giving me wind and rain. You're some kind of butterfly. Bye-bye.